So the first section we have are cubes that cannot be scrambled. These are things like the dodo cube, the one by one, or the dodo one by one. Next up are cubes that can be scrambled, but are so easy that even a baby can do them because there's only one axis that they turn on. Technically the first puzzle on the list being a one by two by N. So this is a two by two by one, which is always three moves from being solved at least. This is the most scrambled it can be. One, two, three, solved easily. With the next puzzle group is puzzles that are actual real puzzles that require actual thinking, but are at the same time so easy that even a baby could still do them. Odds are you will solve one of these by accident or by just like 10 minutes of playing with one. So now we are at a level that is so difficult that most people don't even try to attempt them. This being the 2x2 two two and 2x2 two two mirror, the skewb, and the 2x2x3. Two two we are now at a level that is so difficult that most people cannot even imagine being able to solve one of these puzzles. This being the 3x3, three three, Master Pyramix, and Gear Ball. Many others, of course, belong to this level. So this next level is so popular that I can't even fit all of them on the desk. So this is three by three with extra steps. So it's things like three by three shape mods, three by three picture cubes, void cubes, more like shape-shifting three by threes, mirror blocks, another mirror blocks, mega mixes, and four by fours. So we have the level from before, but with extra steps. And after that is the level from before, but with more extra steps. So then we have the level from before, but with extra steps. Then we have Skubic Shape Mods. And then the most difficult and also dirty puzzle I own, the Bandage Cube. Then of course there are challenge puzzles like this 3x3 that is heat sensitive. And that is it. That is the list of all of the puzzles that I own, ranked from the easiest to the hardest. So, here's a question for you all now. What is the hardest puzzle that you have in your collection? And is it something that I can make a tutorial on?